everyone, it's Jenny here and welcome back to a brand new PV reaction on my channel. Today is one of probably one of my favourite PV reactions for this year because I'm reacting to the newest music video by my favourite K-pop band, Dreamcatcher. This is the music video for Deja Vu. Um, they're currently having a Japanese release and a Korean comeback. This is their Korean comeback Deja Vu and then they've released a Japanese single called Breaking Up which I've already watched and seen a bajillion times and I love the song but with Deja Vu I really want to do a PV reaction to this because I've seen the promo photos, I've seen like little sneak peek trailers for the music video and I'm beyond excited to see this music video. I've been in anticipation for a Dreamcatcher comeback since Piri and it's 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 been too long since I've had more dream catcher um i'm so excited for this music video you have absolutely no idea from what i can see this music video looks like it's going to be absolutely fabulous of course it's going to be great choreography there's going to be amazing vocals because this group is probably the group that's got me back into k-pop um i'd say from like 2013 to 2017 there was like a couple of years where i just i didn't listen to k-pop at all because a lot of my favorite k-pop bands have disbanded like FX, 4 Minute, Girls' Generation, Brown Eyed Girls, among many others. And Dreamcatcher was the one group that's brought me back to K-pop. Um, I'm a big massive fan of a lot of K-pop groups now, but Dreamcatcher is my number one favourite. So I'm so excited for the song. I'm going to get straight into this because I cannot wait any longer. So let's get straight into the music video for Deja Vu. Here we are. I'm guessing it's even gonna... Oh, this is really pretty. I'm liking the setting for this. Oh, yo yo! I love her so much, she's my favourite. Mm. This is really... I've got chills from this. Okay, I love all the girls. They're all like stunning and beautiful and holding this pain. Oh don't kill her, don't kill her. No. This is a really sad song. It's so good. Oh, is this like Judas kind of thing? Those costumes. Oh my god. I wasn't expecting this kind of song, but it's so good. Oh my god, I love this. Those white costumes. Is it here, Young? No, is it Jimmy in the costume? Visuals in this are beyond stunning. They're really, really good. So stunning. Oh, the rules reverse now. Um, oh, not so you. Mm. This is giving me like. Like Judas vibes. Oh, 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 I'm loving like the use of the colour oh, I'm definitely getting like Jesus and Disciple vibes from this. Reverse. Oh wow. Visuals in this are amazing. Oh. This is absolutely oh, this is giving me chills. Oh my god, this is so good. I've got like goosebumps in my arms. 
thoughts about this. This is really good. Wow, dream catcher. Oh wow, that was oh that was I've got chills from that. Um I've got a lot of thoughts in my head. So I have so many thoughts about this music video. Obviously the song I fell in love with it's probably one of the best Dreamcatcher comebacks that I've listened to. Um, Piri and What were obviously fantastic songs, but this one, it just blows the last two songs out of the park. Um, it wasn't what I was expecting, but that's a good thing. Um, from the previews that I've seen of this music video, I did expect another kind of like rock anthem that Dreamcatcher are very well known for, kind of like You and I or Good Night. But this one, it still had that like signature like hard chorus that I love from Dreamcatcher but then you have this like delicate chor uh, these delicate verses where it's such a good contrast to the chorus and because of that with the storyline of the music video it just gave me chills throughout and with this music video I don't know what it is I don't know whether it's because they've got a bigger budget or like more creativity has been put into the music video but from the costumes to the setting to the green screen the graphics to the way that it's been shot it's absolutely phenomenal like I'm in love with the set like this kind of like castle churchy kind of thing and just I've just got chills like I'm so in love with it all of all of the girls sounded amazing like there was nobody kind of pushed to the back they all got given really good screen time and then Jiu and Hyoyeon I'm really sorry if I pronounce names wrong I'm really bad with Korean pronunciation but them two that's like my biggest thing that I love about the music video because they're my two favourite members so for them to kind of have like the centre spot in the storyline was really really good Um, my thoughts about the music video in terms of the storyline I was kind of getting like um Jesus and Judas vibes now if you don't know basically Judas was one of um Jesus' disciples and he betrayed Jesus to the Romans and that's how Jesus ended up on the cross and that's kind of like the vibe that I got from the shot where they had all of the members stood behind the table and smiling together it kind of gave me the whole the the painting that you have with Jesus and the 12 disciples and kind of Judas kind of like sneaking off kind of thing that's what it reminded me of and at the start of the music video I thought Hyoyeon was Jesus and Ji was Judas kind of stabbing her with the sword and you have this kind of like little interaction with them at the table where Hyoyeon's smiling at Jiyu but then kind of her smile kind of fades away so then in the second half of the music video suddenly the roles are reversed and Jiyu ends up in the coffin and Hyoyeon is the one that's kind of on the on the throne so I'm guessing like roles of reverse kind of thing like this like Judas is kind of jealous of Jesus He's jealous of how much of a figure he is for the people and I guess that's kind of like how the roles reverse so Judas kills off Jesus and he becomes the new leader I guess and that's the kind of um that's the kind of story that I got that's my interpretation of it if I'm completely wrong and um, please let me know what your thoughts are down in the comments below for the story and um, it's such a great music video and just the whole religious connotation of it in my opinion I thought was very well executed there wasn't anything that I thought would be offensive for anyone it was just kind of a uh, nobody's the good guy or the bad guy everyone has like two sides of them and everyone's the bad guy and the good guy there's no 100% good and there's not 100% bad and that's kind of what I got from the music video and obviously the whole deja vu title that's what I kind of got where the same situation is happening where Jesus is like at the top and then Judas is the one that kills him off but then the roles are reversed and Judas is on the throne but then there's always that looming threat from Jesus of kind of sending him to hell when he passes away kind of thing that's what I get anyway when it comes to music videos like this I get really deep into the symbolism the storyline and um, because I did media studies at college and we kind of had to like nitpick at different medias and that's just what I get from the music video but again this is an absolutely fantastic comeback from Dreamcatcher. Obviously I'm going to learn the dance to this along with Breaking Up and hopefully there might be a couple of dance covers coming out round about Halloween time because that's when I plan on doing my Dreamcatcher dance cover. Which song? I'm not too sure yet. It just depends on 
which choreography I get down first. But that's just my thoughts on the music video. What do you guys think of the music video? What do you think of the song? And what are your interpretations of the music video? Again, I find it to be such a visual, stunning piece of work. Whoever was the director and the, and the crew behind this, they've done a fantastic job. And it's probably my favourite K-pop comeback so far this year. But to be honest, it's very, very hard to top Dreamcatcher in my eyes. But um, that's just my thoughts about the music video. Um, please let me know what your thoughts are down in the comments below. I love to discuss things with you guys. And until I see you in my next video, have a great night or day wherever you are. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.